viewers welcome to Frenard Farms. What I'm going to do today is to show you how we are going to wash tiger nuts without water. So I've come back to Imaba in the central region of Ghana. Keep watching, stay tuned. So I'm going to introduce farmer and concern to you. He's going to show us what he has on hand to do today. Okay. Today we are on how uh, to clean the tiger nuts before selling. Okay. Uh, so uh, I will take you through how the process is being done. Okay. So quickly, let's go out and then see how it is done. <laughs> Guys, so this is tiger nut you see here. This is not cocoa. okay so we are ready for you so before you process it or you clean it for selling you need to dry it a bit okay. sometimes uh, mine is the early stage of planting so you need to clear it after that you dry it for the sun to uh, use the sun to dry it so that you'll be able to remove the sun the soil from the nuts okay. so easily so from here you move the nuts onto the shank okay. and where we use our hand to separate i would say the shank will separate the sand from the nuts okay so quickly so this, this level that we are now is it good enough to be sent to the shank yeah okay. yeah so now it is dried Will you go and bring more? Yeah. This? Okay. Yeah, no, bring more. So, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. So to this level, then you just use your hand to separate it. So how long can it take for one sack to be completed? One sack? Yes. Well, depending upon the nature of the soil. Mm -hmm. If the place is not all that watery, yes, from the sack, you can even not dry it like this. Mm -hmm. Right away from the sack, then you just separate it. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So not all that, as you see. And these are my friends who have been helping me. Okay. Uh, for the... For the And those smaller ones falling down, will you be picking them? Again? Yes. After that, you use uh, another uh, this thing. We have a basket there. You use it to sieve it. To sieve the to smaller ones. Yeah. So to also to separate the sand. So this separates the smaller ones together with the sand. Okay. Uh -huh, the shank. That is okay. the work of it. Okay. So after that, we have a basket, a perforated one, okay. that we use it to separate the sand, so that we get a smaller one. So it is no waste. Okay, okay. Yeah, it's not waste.
it looks like it is getting cleaner and cleaner are you done yeah please we have a fabric basket number in your frame room So you can see the soil that they used for the planting of the tiger nuts being cleaned down. And then also you can see some of the tiger nuts here it has been mixed with the soil. This one is very smooth soil. So all these will be collected and it will also be sieved with another basket so that all these ones didn't go waste. But we are still in the process. We are not done yet. Stay tuned and subscribe to Freenet Farms. This is in Mabasa, in the central region of Ghana. <coughs> the closest town to Mabasa is Kufukraso. Okay, so that's the basket that they are bringing. Very big basket. So you are going to put this inside? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Then what do you do? From here, we, we, we will add more. From where? From the dried one, the one that we we, we clean it on the first face. Okay. Uh -huh. We need to add more so that it will come up a bit. Mm. Uh -huh. Without it coming up, you can't do the. Oh no, we can do it. Maybe yours is not for that much. And for that matter, you need to do it. Mm -hmm. Just if it is more like this. Okay. You can do it. But those ones that we are talking about, that we're supposed to add, are not ready. Okay. So we just process this. Mm. Uh, so pull it, push it to the side. No, no, no. The crate I'm talking about. This side. And the process is also being done in a rotational base. Mm. As and when we'll be cleaning it, you see that we'll be rotating. Okay. Ah. So that is it. Okay. So, My viewers will love to see this. Okay. So let's start. We'll go this way. Ah, so we'll go this way. So you can see they are rotating their hands in the basket. You made the edge Guys, this work is not easy. And they are doing everything in the sun. So you can imagine how tedious it will be. Look at this man, the way he's standing here. <laughs> <laughs> the work is not easy. It's not. Not easy at all. So you're now done. Yeah. It looks very neat as compared to how it yeah, was yeah, before, first stage. before the thing. Guys, see the difference. Look can have this. And then let's go see how it was before they started working on it. This was how it was looking. You can see this one. 
with all the yeah. soil and everything. Yeah, you do. See this? And you see the difference that this one is looking very, very neat. So after this, what do you do? So from here, then we select the bad ones, as I said, from it. Okay. Some will be infected by the uh, fungus, others too by the insects. Okay. Uh, this one was attacked by the insects. Mm. Yes. Like this. Mm. We were attacked by the insects. This is very visible. Yeah. Okay. By the insects. And this is the one with death. Let me. Uh -huh. This is the fungus. Mm. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And sometimes too, when losing the soil for harvesting too, the hoe will be cutting some of the nuts. Mm. But I want to be yeah, classified as rejected nuts. Okay. Uh -huh. So that was those ones too, you need to remove, remove everything. Yeah, like this. So those ones to move all. Uh -huh. And then mm. this one too. Yes. So who mm. does that? Do you have people who? Do yeah, that? we have people. Sometimes when you finish, the the, the market man comes to help you to do that separation. Okay. So uh, they are the people. So we even have some of the women inside. Who yeah, inside who are working on that. Doing the sorting. Yeah, doing the sorting. Okay. So you, you pour this into a pan or? Yeah, we pour it into a pan and then we send it to the women for the sorting. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hmm? <laughs> You see that it's similar to it is yeah it looks very nice so they are doing the sorting mm. uh -huh. the unwanted ones are being sorted from the okay correct yeah so after the sorting what happens after the sorting the buyer will come and then measure it mm. and he will come and then buy it so as it is we have customers that we've been working with Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So the customer will come. So before even the processing, I even have to contact him or her. Okay. Uh -huh. that, so that as soon as you finish, yes, they then come they will come. It. Yeah, they'll come and pick okay. it. Now I can see someone doing something in the basket. What is she also doing? She's also cleaning. Yeah, uh, yeah, she's also cleaning. So in the absence of the big basket, mm. you can just get this one and then you do the cleaning. Okay. You see that it is getting same as what we did in the basket. Yeah. Uh -huh. But this one it will not contain much of the nuts. Mm. And that is why we have that one in it. The big one. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. So this will save you water. You don't need water to clean. So you don't use water. Okay. You don't use water. And you also mentioned that um the smaller ones are poured down with the soil yeah. it's also be sorted uh, you said you use some baskets no this is what we use this is the same basket yes we use, we use. Ah, okay. so we use this to collect all the smaller together with the sand okay and after that we shake it for the sand to ooze up uh, out and then we get the smaller ones okay yeah mm. so we are still working on the tiger nuts we are cleaning them and as you can see it's very tedious to do this kind of work but it's very lucrative you can do it well and get your right customers who wouldn't come and cheat you you make money from it so keep watching and subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet so the women that will be coming to work for you how much would they be charging for the work they do okay actually the cleaning of the nuts the final stage 
Yeah. It is not being done by women. Mm. Uh, because it needs more energy. So, as usual, it's supposed to be men. Oh, okay. So, when they do it, mm. one full of baskets, yeah. uh, full of this, is 80 CDs. Mm. Uh, so, when they clean this for you, it's 80 CDs. So, we have men who have been doing that. But, but you are already doing this. Oh, it's too because much because the year the work is too much for me, so you need to hire people to do that for you. Mm. Uh -huh. Normally, you do the shanking and then they will do the final stage of mm. the clinic. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. So, viewers, you've seen how the tiger nut is gotten from the farm through to how it is cleaned with the shanks before it gets to the basket, the big basket behind me, that's it. Before finally it gets to the women who will do the sorting. And it's a bit tedious. Looking at how much he earns and the work he does, I think it's so worth it. Because if you stay home, that you are not doing anything, you will also get money. So you can do Tiger Nut Farm and you are going to make money from it. Despite the fact that the work is a bit tedious. If you've enjoyed this video, I will entreat you to subscribe to Trainer Farms and then watch other videos that I've done on Tiger Nuts on this channel. The links will be in the description. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.